All right, if you are watching this tutorial, you want to add, you want to change your favicon, uh, which is the first optional change. Remember, these optional changes you don't have to do. So a fav favicon, if you don't know what it is, uh, you know like when you look at the top tab of your browser, each one of the different um, tools that you use has a little picture next to it. So like, unfortunately on an iPad, you can't see a favicon, but if you ever open it up on a desktop or a laptop, instead of having just an X there, there's a little picture, right? And so that's what a favicon is. And so these are some famous favicons. Right now, if I look at my index.html page, um, so my favicon right now is located on line six. And what it actually is, is this, this little ice cream picture. So if I wanted to change my favicon, well, I just need to replace that picture there. So uh, the way that I would do it is I would look for a, uh, like a, a, an emoji or some kind of image, or I could make my own image. So I might just go like wolf emoji or something like that. And all you have to do is find a favicon that you would want and then just go ahead and add it to your photos. Okay. And then when I go back here, I need to upload an asset. And so it's in my photo library. And so I'm going to add my um, wolf there. And now that that's added in, I need to select on it just like I did to my picture. Oops. If I select on it and then I've got a URL, I'm going to copy that URL. I'm going to go back to index.html. I'll click it twice. And here is the long favicon that existed before. And again, it's kind of a pain to just delete. Hopefully you're smarter than me and you figured out a way to easily like select the whole thing and delete. But unfortunately, like uh, for whatever reason, maybe it's just too late. Uh, I'm having to, you know, individually delete each character. But either way, once you get to the end, um, I can go ahead and now paste my new favicon there. Oops, once I paste it. So here's the thing. Again, on an iPad, you're not going to be able to see it, uh, a favicon show up. But if you send it to your parents and they can pull it up on their desktop or laptop, you'll see your favicon there. That's how you change a favicon.